Top 10 Richest Mineral Producing Countries in Africa Africa is home to huge and plentiful natural resource deposits, with resources ranging from large cobalt reserves found throughout the mineral-rich plains of the Congo to black gold, more often known as oil. Nearly all precious minerals that are necessary for creating money, producing goods, and improving technology are found in Africa. Because of their mineral endowments, some African countries have developed, some more so than others. Roughly 30% of the world's total mineral reserves are located in Africa. While some nations are dependent on oil, others are wealthy in diamonds, gold, copper, cobalt, coal, iron ore, and other minerals. South Africa, Nigeria, Algeria, Angola, and Libya produce more than two-thirds of Africa's mineral wealth thanks to their substantial oil reserves. According to a study by the Economist Group's Research and Analysis Division, Economist Intelligence Unit, with the exception of South Africa, which has an abundance of natural resources. According to the paper, high prices for commodities like copper, oil, iron ore, aluminum, and gas will promote investment and all work to reduce external imbalances, stabilize currencies, and advance economic growth. Across the continent, exports are booming due to rising commodity prices. In today's episode, we will be looking at the top 10 richest mineral producing countries in Africa. Fasten your seat belt as we go on this joy ride. 10. Ghana As 37% of all exports from Ghana are minerals, the country's export industry is significantly boosted by its mineral wealth. Ghana produces more than 15% of the gold on the continent, trailing only South Africa in terms of output. The second largest portion of the nation's mineral exports is made up of gold. Ghana has also begun further mining exploration in bauxite, manganese, and diamond reserves, but gold remains the focus. Behind the Ivory Coast, the nation produces the second most cocoa. Annual minerals production, $14,979. Niger Niger is one of the continent's top producers, accounting for 44% of the continent's uranium supply. More than 40% of Niger's exports are made up of mineral exports. Despite the fact that Niger also produces gypsum, limestone, salt, silver, tin, cement, coal, coal, gypsum, and tin, the Agadez region in the north, a desert to the northeast of Niamey is well known for its substantial uranium reserves. Since 1971, there have been mines operating in the region. Uranium is most frequently used in the nuclear power industry to produce electricity because it is naturally radioactive. 8. Guinea Numerous valuable and high-quality minerals can be found in Guinea. With over 22% of global production, it is the second largest bauxite producer in the world. It contains the largest undeveloped iron ore resource in the entire globe. Guinea also boasts 30 to 40 million carats of diamond reserves and is the seventh largest gold producer in Africa. The economy depends on these resources. In 2018, the mining industry contributed $544 million to government coffers, or more than 30% of the state budget. But despite this almost unrivaled resource richness, Guinea continues to be one of the world's poorest and least developed nations. More than 95% of Africa's bauxite production is attributable to Guinea, with the remaining 5% going to Ghana. Bauxite, an ore of aluminum, is essential for the manufacturing of aluminum. In 2005, Guinea was the only African producer of alumina and synthetically generated aluminum oxide. The nation maintains its crucial position in meeting the global demand for aluminum. It has a huge potential with 40 billion proven tons of deposits, according to estimates. The quantity of its high-quality iron that is exploited results in an annual output of 100 million tons. 7. Zambia Zambia, a landlocked nation in southern Africa, is home to a wide variety of animals and has numerous parks and safari locations. Famous Victoria Falls, also known as Mozi Otunya or Smoke That Thunders in the local language, are located on Zimbabwe's border and plunge 108 meters into the confined Batoka Gorge. 
A stunning vantage point is the Victoria Falls Bridge, which spans the Zambezi River immediately below the falls. Between 65% and 77% of Africa's copper supply is found in Zambia, making it the continent's top copper producer. The nation can provide jobs for its residents and boost the gross domestic product of the entire country thanks to its numerous productive mines. Copper wires are typically utilized for electrical wiring in the building and construction industries because they are effective heat conductors. In order to create brass and bronze, it is also alloyed with iron and other metals, and cookware is made from these materials. 6. Mozambique High-quality coking coal and thermal coal, graphite, iron ore, titanium, apatite, marble, bentonite, bauxite, kaolin, copper, gold, rubies, and tantalum are among the commercially significant minerals found in Mozambique. Some of the greatest undeveloped coal reserves in the world are found in Mozambique. Though the mining industry in Mozambique only accounted for 1.5% of the country's economy in 2012, the sector is expected to expand by more than 10% in the coming years as coal and gas become more and more widely mined. However, as things stand, Mozambique continues to be an important producer of aluminum, accounting for 32% of Africa's supply. 5. Tanzania Tanzania produces the fourth most gold in Africa. However, the mining sector only contributes slightly more than 3% of the country's GDP. As the mining industry develops, that number might increase in coming years. Impressive amounts of iron, ore, nickel, copper, cobalt, silver, diamond, and other minerals can be found in Tanzania. Northeast Tanzania, home to Mount Kilimanjaro, is steep and heavily forested. A portion of Tanzania is home to three of Africa's Great Lakes. Both Lake Victoria, the largest lake in Africa, and Lake Tanganyika, the deepest lake on the planet and home to several rare fish species, are located to the north and west of the region. South of here is Lake Malawi. The Zanzibar Archipelago is nearby, but the eastern shore is hot and humid. 4. Nigeria Nigeria's stocks of vital minerals, like lithium, manganese, and nickel, are in high demand due to the worldwide push for green energy solutions, prompting the government to announce a number of programs that will accelerate foreign direct investment into the industry. Nigeria is endowed with gold, columbite, wolframite, tantalite, bitumen, iron ore, and uranium in addition to its huge oil reserves. Amazingly, the mining sector is still incredibly underdeveloped and only contributes 0.3% to the nation's GDP, which suggests that there will be a ton of opportunity in the years to come. $52,678 million in annual mineral output. 3. Democratic Republic of Congo The Democratic Republic of the Congo, formerly known as ZAIR, and also known as Congo Kinshasa, is a nation in Central Africa. The DRC is the 11th largest country in the world and the second largest in Africa by land area, behind Algeria. Despite having untapped raw mineral ore deposits worth more than $24 trillion, the Democratic Republic of the Congo is still one of Africa's top producers of copper, 13%, and it also ranks among the top producers of diamonds, 35%. The Democratic Republic of the Congo, however, is still plagued by crime and corruption, and many mining operations have to be shut down in order to stop unlawful activity. Gem-quality diamonds make up the majority of the supply. There are also mines for gold, nickel, copper, soda ash, and diamonds. 2. Botswana The Okavango Delta, which transforms into a lush animal habitat during the periodic floods, and the Kalahari Desert define the environment of Botswana, a landlocked nation in southern Africa. Giraffes, cheetahs, hyenas, and wild dogs are among the many creatures that call the vast central Kalahari Game Reserve, with its fossilized river basins and undulating grasslands home. The world's top producer of diamonds by value, Botswana is home to 35% of Africa's diamonds, the majority of which are gem quality. Diamonds continue to be the main material in Botswana and make up the majority of its gross domestic product, despite the fact that the nation also produces other minerals like copper, gold, nickel, and soda ash.
In addition to the United Nations, Botswana is a member of the Southern African Customs Union, the Southern African Development Community, the Commonwealth of Nations, and the African Union. 1. South Africa The country generates a lot of coal, diamonds, iron ore, and chromium in addition to its 35 gold mines. Despite all the good signs, the working environment for mining businesses is challenging due to high levels of criminality, an expensive and unstable electrical supply, logistical bottlenecks on the rail and in the ports, and a backlog of almost 4,000 mining and exploration permits. In addition to being the second largest producer of ilmenite, palladium, rutile, and zirconium in the world, South Africa is the world's largest producer of manganese, platinum, vanadium, and vermiculite. Minerals produced annually $124,963 million. With the growing discovery of minerals in Africa, it is safe to say that economic growth is bound to shine its light on the African continent sooner than we think. Without misappropriation of funds and diligence in government management, Africa will be heading for the top. Thanks for watching. Do well to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the notification button for more interesting updates.